Doesn't that smell delicious? Darling, is something wrong? It's just this simple life. It's just so dreary. Oh, I long to be rich and envied and oh, having a fancy dress or fancy jewels. That reminds me. This came for us today. Monsieur and Mademoiselle, you are cordially invited to attend the Palace of Ministry on Monday evening, January 18th, at the request of the Minister of Public Instruction and Madame Georges Rampineau. What am I supposed to make of this? But darling, why wouldn't you want to go? You never go out, and this is a very highly sought-after invitation. It was very difficult for me to get it. Why wouldn't you want to go? I have nothing to wear! Not a dress! How can you expect me to attend a ball without a fancy dress? Okay, Mathilde. How much would a dress cost? It's 400 francs. Ooh. Well, I was hoping to buy a gun to go hunting, but my wife is more important. Come on. We'll buy you that dress. <laughs> Darling, why are you so upset? We found the nicest dress for you for the ball. Why are you crying? I do not have a single jewel to wear with my new dress. Not even one stone. I'd rather not go to the ball at all than wear nothing with a dress and look so plain while everyone else looks so rich. No, Mathilde, what? don't be foolish. Why don't you go see your friend Madame Forestier? I'm sure she has a jewel or two she could lend to you. Of course. Madame Forestier, she'll have definitely have something I can borrow. Oh, Madame, it is so good to see you. Oh, and I understand your situation. If I could only borrow something exquisite, I promise I'll return it right after the ball. Of course, please. I have so many jewels to choose from. Take your pick. Oh, well, I don't know. Oh, now, wait a minute. What's this? Oh, it's simply divine. May I borrow this necklace? Only this, that's all I ask. Why, yes, of course, certainly. Oh, thank you. Thank you ever so much. attractive woman at that ball. Oh, I'm sorry, dear, that I left you alone, but ah. I just wanted to go off and be alone to dance and to be admired. Oh, yes. Dry up in my beauty. Yes, darling. It was a night to remember, that's for sure. What? What's, what's wrong? It's gone! Madame Foyestia's necklace! What? Oh. No, she, no, did you, are you sure you didn't leave it at the no, ball? No, 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 I felt it when we were in the vestibule. Oh, sh okay. Um... I'm gonna go search for it, I will retrace our steps and find it. Oh, no. what's, what's wrong? It's gone! Darling, it's been a week and I've had no luck finding the necklace. Now, I think that you need to write your friend, tell her that we broke the clasp or something and we're just having it mended. That will give us enough time to turn this around. This is useless. I think we need to think of a way to replace it. Well, I did find this one. And it looks remarkably like the original. But it cost 36,000 francs. You'll have to borrow the money to pay for that necklace. We'll have to borrow and compensate the rest of our lives. No matter what misery comes our way, we'll be prepared. We must replace that necklace. I'll return it to Madame Forestier and hope she doesn't notice the difference. It was a lovely ball, but I, again, I'm sorry for returning this so late. Well, I should say so. What if I needed it sooner? I'm sorry. But again, thank you so much. Of course. Well, I should say... Honey! Darling. She took the case back and didn't even open it. Madame Forestier took back the necklace without even checking. We're safe, we're in the clear. She'll never know that I lost your necklace and had to replace it. Yes, darling, but now we have to work to pay off our debt. We're going to have to do all the work ourselves now. Now, I've let the servants go, and we're going to have to move to smaller quarters. 
It's going to take us a long time to pay off that debt. Darling, you know what I did this morning? I paid off the last of that debt. Oh. Ten years we have been paying that loan off, and now finally it's over. It's been so exhausting. All this work just to pay off the debt of one necklace. I've never been so relieved. I've never been so tired either. I think I'll take a walk. I'm sorry, do I know you? It is I, Madame Loiselle. Madame Loiselle? I never would have recognized you. You look so different. Well, I've had many days of hard work because of you. Because of me? Yes, because of the necklace that I lost of yours. Lost? No, you returned that necklace oh, to me. Actually, I lost it and we had to replace it. It's been ten years of us paying it back and that's why I look so wretched. Oh no, you say that you bought a necklace to replace that one? Yes, and you never even noticed because they look so much alike. Oh, Madame Loiselle, that necklace, it was just costume jewelry, just paste. It wasn't worth more than 500 francs. 